So let's continue our tour. So you can see down here, you know, drywall was put up, but um, we're missing it on this side. Um, we're also missing these as well. Um, and then we're gonna go into a paneled, lovely room um, on the back side of the lowest level. There is an egress window to get out in case of a fire. Um, you can see the ceilings. There hasn't been much, much updating since the home was built back here. Again, I'm not seeing any issues on the ceiling from leakage, which is wonderful. So this is just kind of a quarter angle from the lowest family room in the lowest level. Always want to look at windows, make sure there's no seepage. Okay. So let's head back upstairs. Get an outside to your backyard, walk out. Definitely get your workout in this home, which is great. I actually grew up in a split level, so they're dear to my heart. We're gonna go up to the low, the highest level, the upper level, I should say. This is where you're gonna find your other three bedrooms. Two of the three are on a bit on the smaller side, but definitely doable. Closet space. You could probably fit a queen bed in here. There wouldn't be much room for anything else, maybe a dresser. And then we're gonna go into the second room. Again, I would like to say this is probably the smallest bedroom up here. That's gonna be for your bathroom plumbing in case you need to access that. So I'd say this is probably more of a full-size bed option if you wanted to put anything else in the room. Here is the full bath that your, your guests or your family members would be using on this level. And as you can see, there's a cup, there's some paint chipping away right there. Um, and that actually happened on my own home in my basement too as well. Not significant of any water damage. It just looks like um, it was not a professional paint job. And sometimes that happens. So this is going to be the master ensuite. Okay, so this is a nice size room, absolutely. You could get a king in here, no problem, have lots of extra space for other items. And I love this because you do have an ensuite. So you do have your own three-fourths bathroom. Now here in Minnesota, three-fourths bathroom is just a sink, a bath, excuse me, a sink, a toilet, and a shower. It doesn't offer a bathtub. But you do have two full baths, which is lovely, and then a three-fourths bath. A lot of times you're gonna find maybe a three-fourths bath, maybe a full bath, and then maybe a half bath. So this does offer a little bit more than the average bear. And you have a beautiful walk-in closet. So lots of space in this room. Lots of space. And we're gonna go back downstairs. And we are just gonna get one last view from the front door. So you can kind of see what it looks like to come in from the front door, the entryway, the light, this lovely bonus room right here. And you can just see all the natural light. So let me know if you have any other questions on this one, okay? Thanks.